everyone. So I'm at YouTube and I'm going to go to my profile in the upper right corner and go to YouTube Studio. And I wanted to show you a couple things in YouTube Studio. Once you go here, click Videos on the left menu, and then you should see all of your videos that you've um, uploaded. And uh, let's take a look at the first one. If I click on this first thumbnail, and then I click Subtitles on the left menu, here, this is one that I just uploaded, and it says Add under Subtitles. And if you see Add, that means that the automatic captions have not actually been created yet. Do not click Add. That will disrupt the automatic captions. You want to just wait. So after you've uploaded a video, you do need to wait uh, for the captions to process, and you might need to just step away for a few hours and do something else. Now let's take a look at another video where the, the captions have already processed. Let's see, if I do that, I'm going to click this thumbnail for this video. Then I'm going to click Subtitles on the left menu. And here we can see it says Subtitles Published Automatic, Duplicate and Edit. So I am looking for those automatic captions. They are published. And I can click Duplicate and Edit. This is going to create another track on top of my automatic track that I can then edit. So I'm going to click Continue. All right, now here is the automatic captions on the left, and I would just start editing these. I'm going to add capital letters. I'm going to add uh, punctuation for sentences. I'm just going to kind of check and see if there's anything that needs to be corrected, right? And I'm going to correct it, especially like capital I. Um, and the, yeah, there's no sentence uh, punctuation, which is hard to read. So you're just going to go through and you're going to correct the capital letters, the punctuation, any errors that you see, especially, you know, in your own name, for example, often YouTube gets that wrong. Um, so just do that. And then you can always save your draft if you're worried about losing your edits. And then when you're ready, you can also publish. I will show you one more thing, though. Um, if you need to listen to your video, you can play it here if you don't remember exactly what you said. If you want to look at the actual timings of the captions, you can click Assign Timings. That's going to show you what they'll actually look like um, as captions on the screen. You can always go back to editing as the text again, however you want to do it. But as soon as you click Save, it saves it. And then as soon as you click Publish, those edited captions will now be available on your video on YouTube. So now you see I have two tracks. I have the one that I did. Um, published by Creator, and that's the English language captions. And then I have the automatic track still here underneath it. Now, if I wanted to, I could delete the automatic captions if I didn't want those to be available. I could click the three dot icon and I could delete them if I wanted to. Uh, that's another option. And that way, the only track on my video are those ones that I had edited. And if I need to go back in and edit again, I can do that, right? Um, and then if I want to make sure, I can click over here and view my video on YouTube. And when I do that, okay, so. I see here are my captions. If you don't see them, click the CC button. CC turns them on. And these are English captions, not automatic. Okay, good luck. And if you have any questions, let us know.